It's not usually a pleasure visiting the dentist, especially when cavities are involved. But researchers are working with robotics to make sure your fillings can withstand the test of time and keep you out of the dentist okay, chair. So set that for you now. Traditional fillings are usually a mix of various metals, but new materials like zirconium and porcelain are coming into play more often. Testing these materials is where the chewing robot comes in. Clinical trials last between two and three years. We can speed it up to five to ten days. While there are other machines to test materials, the robot is designed to accurately replicate all the motions and pressures exerted by the human jaw. If it doesn't pass a first hurdle, which this machine could actually sort of be the first hurdle, then, then it's no point in putting that, machine, putting that material onto the test for the, for the next uh, clinical trial and spending a huge sum of resources on it. Tina Salmon is one patient who is benefiting from the use of advanced composites. I've been brushing my teeth too hard, so I've brushed away the enamel at the, between the gum and the top of my tooth. So I've had to have that filled in to protect the, to protect the tooth. So it's really important, especially when you're up by your, your gum, that, that it's so sort of cosmetically looks so real and it's not so obvious that it's a filling. That's really important to me. And with healthcare taking center stage, keeping costs low means searching for ever newer composites and faster ways to get them to market. Tim McGuire, the Associated Press.